Hey everybody, welcome back to our weekly live stream show called Audio Advice High Notes right here on Facebook. Thank you so much for tuning in. Like I said, we do this every single week at one o'clock. Uh, so make sure that you are tuning in every single week at one. This week, I have the pleasure of having our founder of Audio Advice on the show, Mr. Leon Shaw. Thank you so much for joining me. Happy to be here today. All right, so I'm bringing you on because we are talking about high performance turntables today. So the Ferraris, the Lamborghinis of our industry, if you will. Now, before we dive into that, I want to make sure that everybody knows there's absolutely nothing wrong with getting an entry-level turntable, sub $500. Not at all. We actually sell... We sell tons of yeah. these to people that are just getting into vinyl or people getting back into vinyl and want to get their toes wet in it. But yep. You can get great turntables for under $500. It's a, I mean, it's a great price point. You can get awesome turntables for that price point. And we actually have a couple articles that I think people would be interested in. We have the 10 best turntables underneath $500 right. on our website. And we also have a complete turntable buyer's guide on our website, which I believe you probably crafted that. Yeah, I wrote the whole thing. Okay, so you wrote the whole thing, so go check out our website. Make sure after this video, of course, watch the live stream, go check out our website. We have hundreds of blogs, buyer's guides, videos on our website. So you go to the website and you'll click on blog on the main page, and that basically is the key that unlocks the kingdom, so to it speak, is. and all the content is behind there. We've been busy typing. We, You've been very busy typing. I think you are also, can I say that you're working on a big new buyer's guide coming soon? Theater. Okay, yep. so a complete home theater buyer's guide coming soon, 30-ish pages maybe? Uh, probably, yeah. Okay, all right, so he'll be busy doing that over the next couple of months, so stay tuned for that coming out. Today we're going to be talking about those high performance turntables and one of the questions that a lot of people ask when they're coming in and they're looking for a new turntable is really what's the price point that I need to expect when I'm getting into the high performance side of turntables? Well for the turntable and cartridge probably $1,500 and up. Okay. I'd say the ones that people get one and then call us back and say, oh my gosh, this is amazing. They're 3000 okay. in that category. So now what makes a turntable at that price point, what makes it so good? I know there are a couple of things that go into making turntables and, and really set them apart, but what are a few things that really set turntables apart? Well, there, there's a few actually, that at least I believe that are okay. important. So I think speed control or speed consistency is super important. And that has to do with usually a heavy platter and a motor that's really well controlled. And if the platter has a great flywheel effect, once it gets spinning at a really constant speed, the speed is just so pure when you hear something that's rhythmic, like a live concert, you yep. just want to get up and start tapping your yeah, finger. Yeah, absolutely. Know, just get something in you. Yeah. Uh, then they're going to have much better isolation from acoustic feedback. You're playing your speakers in the room, you don't want that sound to get into your turntable. Okay. So the better tables are much better isolated from that. And that will usually get you a lot better bass response, a lot more dynamic impact out of the table. So you enjoy your music. And enjoy, even, again, yep. enjoy the music. Yep. And the thing that a lot of people don't realize until they get a great one is if you get a really good cartridge and tone arm combination, because the tone arm is very important because that's what the tracking is, yep. your surface noise just goes away. Okay. It's and that's an amazing important. effect. Yeah, because it sounds better. Because yep. your background noise just drops, so the notes all come out of more of a black space. It's and really I, cool. And I think that's where, you know, kind of, if I can go down a little bit of a side lane here, that's where a, uh, people sometimes make a little bit of a mistake. They they go out and they get the entry level turntable, and then they go out and maybe get you know a couple thousand dollars worth of speakers, and they come back and go, man, the speakers don't sound very good. And because it's only as good as your source. Yep. The sound starts with the turntable, and the better your turntable is, and cartridge, of course. Yep. The better your ultimate system is going to sound. So now we've just reviewed. We've we've got a new high end or high performance turntable in the Rega Planar Eight, and it's yes. brand new. And you just spent a lot of time with it. And I did. Wrote it was a amazing. Wrote a complete yep. review. Um, tell us a little bit about that turntable. So I was, uh, that one really surprised me at how little surface noise it had. I tested it with the Aspeta cartridge, Aspeta okay. 2, a regular cartridge, and it's got a great new tone arm on this table. And every record I played, you know, I cleaned them first on our ultra disc cleaning sure. machine. There was just no noise, unless there was a pop. Of course, then you hear the pop. But yep. you normally hear that little kind of rushing noise in the background. Yep. It was just gone. 
and the rhythm of this turns out was just great. Every song I play, I just like, yeah, I just bounce in my head. So it got you into the music, music, and which is the goal of a a good turntable. Yeah, and the separation of instruments and how three dimensional they were in front of me, that was it was amazing. Now, what was what else did you pair with that turntable? You know, Uh, what were the speakers that we had it hooked up to a pair of BMW 802s? Okay. And then we had the new Cambridge Edge stack with their preamp and powering, yep. which sounds great. Yep. And then we had, I was testing a new Primo and a Phono stack. It's got little tubes in it, and that thing sounded really good, too. Okay. So that, that combo was probably probably $25,000 for the whole system. All right. The, that that certainly is a Ferrari yeah. of the industry, yeah, yeah. for sure. Yeah, it yeah. sounded amazing. Well, it, it should. <laughs> um, now, I'm going to put you on the spot real quick. Uh, I know that we, we didn't kind of really talk about this question uh, early on, but what is your favorite song to test a system to? Oh, wow. I've got so yeah. many. Oh, maybe top three then. Well, one is um, the Rolling Stones. Okay. You can't always get what you want. It comes in with this choir, and there's yep. a French horn in the background, yep. and if it's right, that French horn just kind of floats out in space. So I'll go with that. You go with that I'll one? I'll go with that one. Okay. All right. I'll take that as, as a good answer. Well, thank you again for joining us and uh, giving us your knowledge about high-performance turntables. Now, we do have a giveaway going on for the month of February. It's a little bit different than what we normally do. We normally do kind of a turntable powered speaker uh, setup, but this this month we're giving away a pair of headphones. They're the Odyssey Mobius headphones. Oh, those are cool. Yeah, they are pretty cool. I heard those the other day. So you've tested them out? Yeah, Nick had a pair of them there, and you... You turn your head around and the stuff moves with your head. It's yeah. really cool. So it's kind of, kind of like the 360. So if you're into playing video games in the first player shooter, you're actually hearing people, you know, when they're coming up behind you on your right hand side, you actually hear that, which is, it's kind of creepy, but it's really, really cool. Yeah. Um, so we are pairing those with an Audio Quest Dragonfly DAC. So it's over $500 value that we are giving away. So go onto our website. Complete the entry form. We have a few ways that you can get a a couple of bonus entries by following us on Instagram and YouTube and all that fun stuff. So we are dropping the link to the giveaway uh, in the description below into this video. And uh, make sure you guys go on, check that out. And don't forget, we will see you guys next week. We do this every single week, 1 o'clock, right here on Facebook. We will be talking about home theater receivers. We'll see you guys next week.